6 house clearance chores a rubbish removal company will happily do. Here is our list of 6 house clearance chores your local rubbish removal company will do for you. Not many people realize that good local waste skip companies are often willing to quote you a price for additional labor. They'll give prices, not just for providing a skip and collecting it later, but for doing a lot more than that. Don't be one of the many who lift loads beyond their capability. Excessive lifting could mean suffering backache the next day, or even, cause a chronic back pain problem. Keep watching for our list of, 6 house clearance chores they can happily do for you. 1. Garage clearance. Decluttering garages and carports is often needed. It's a fact of life that we use our garages to store items when we are too busy to take to our local recycling center. Other items get put there when we are not sure we won't need them again. Garage clutter accumulates. There's no room for the car. If it becomes too much to handle, call in the garage rubbish removal experts from your local clearance service who will clear the space quickly and efficiently. Number 2. Loft clearance. Emptying loft spaces in houses is an obvious task for calling in rubbish removal contractors. Many people put off clearing their loft and the clutter grows, not to mention the cobwebs and layers of dust. Just leave that loft ladder where it is and call your local house clearance contractor. For older people lacking the agility to enter cramped loft spaces and balance on narrow, wood joists etc, this service is a must. Number 3. Builders Waste Clearance. Although most good builders automatically remove and dispose of the building waste, not all of them do, and some simply forget. On top of that, DIY building work can produce a surprisingly large quantity of unsightly rubbish. It's heavy. It's dirty, and may contain sharp objects to be very wary of. If you have builder's waste to clear, and you are not a rugged guy or gal with a six-pack to exercise, just call a clearance company. Number 4. 4. Shed Demolition and Clearance. Have you got a garden shed full of junk that needs clearing? Are you moving house? Or, does the shed need emptying before knocking it down? Clearance companies can make short work of all this. Number 5. Garden Rubbish Clearance. Do you blitz your garden, rather than garden every week to keep the undergrowth at bay? If so, you'll be familiar with the problem of filling your green bin in 10 minutes flat. The solution is to get a quote for garden rubbish removal. Finally, number 6. Household Rubbish Clearance. House clearance and waste disposal service providers offer household rubbish clearance. It's what they do most, and they can quote you for clearing single items, right up to full house clearances. That's our list of six waste chores completed, but before you go, here is a reminder to act responsibly, look after the environment, and watch out for waste law. Not every waste contractor is honest about where they dispose of your rubbish, and illegal fly tipping has risen recently. Every individual in the UK has a legal responsibility to observe their waste duty of care. You have a legal duty to care about where your waste goes. This law is to ensure that your waste isn't simply dumped, fly tipped, in a quiet lane or field near you. Be aware that UK residents should always check that their waste contractor is a registered waste carrier by going to the link bit.ly slash noflytip which is also given below. When on that public register page, you should simply copy your contractor's UK waste registered carrier number which you get from the waste company website and paste it into the EA's website where it says quick check. When the database search comes back and shows you your contractor's correct address, you are done. But, it's also wise to follow the wire scrap code, and do keep a record in case you are later questioned by the authorities. We hope you found this useful, and if you did, please share this video, and subscribe.